Hey everyone, Eric here from Music Gear Network and of course the Helix Hour. From a request from a Line 6 Marketplace customer, Les Brown, I've made a video for today that will hopefully show you how easy it is to purchase and download presets for many Line 6 products including Helix, HX Stomp, Pod Go, HX Effects and more. Nine times out of ten if there is a problem downloading your newly purchased presets, it is usually an account issue or one of a couple steps have been missed. Don't feel bad, I make the simplest of mistakes myself. Also in the description of this video and pinned in the comments, I have provided a link directly to a section on the Line 6 support website that re-emphasizes everything I have said here in the video. Sometimes people grasp more when reading, so we've provided two helpful ways for you to successfully download your new purchases. Okay, let's jump into the video and get started and I promise we'll make this very easy for you. Okay, first things first, you wanna make sure that you have the device that you wanna download presets for uh, plugged in via USB to your computer, not to a hub, directly to the computer and have it powered on. For argument's sake today, we're using HX Stomp. I'm not sure if you can see it there, but got on the desktop, we're plugged in, hooked in via USB. We wanna go over to the Line 6 website at line6.com. Okay, now if you don't have a user account profile, one thing I would suggest you to do, and you haven't registered any of your gear, watch my other video, I'll put a card up at the top, called So You've Got a New Line 6 Helix, What Do You Do Now? Now of course, the same concept will apply to any product that you buy from Line 6, telling you how to register it and update it. That video is very helpful as well too. But very simply, you go to the website, you see the little icon up at the top here, um, that's to sign in or create an account. If you don't have an account, create it. Follow those steps. You probably have to verify your account with an email, link, whatever. And then once you're ready to log back in, which we're going to do right now, I'll use my credentials, and we're going to sign in. We're going to be talking about my presets here today, but there are many great sellers on Line 6 Marketplace. You can either get to my presets here at the Line 6 website slash marketplace, or you can also get them at my official website, which is line6helixpresets.com. You can scroll through there and get a little bit of a read up on my presets and everything. You can't buy them from here. Technically, it's going to jump you over to the uh, marketplace anyways. It's just a nice little catch-all for, for uh, people to accidentally discover me. So now we're going to go over to Line 6 Marketplace, and I'll put that link directly in the description. So we'll type it in, Marketplace. Okay. Here we are. There we go. All right. So we're gonna go. We're gonna go buy a preset right now. I'm gonna show you how easy this is to put it on your device. Okay. So we're gonna go grab this one here. Uh, HX Stomp Stomp Trifecta, and we're using the Stomp today. So we're gonna go add to cart. Okay. And we're ready to check out. There's a price. I'm ready to check out here right now. So proceed to check out. You can buy more presets if you want. Some of this stuff here I will blank out. So we'll fill all this stuff in, and we're gonna continue to the, the final checkout. Okay. We're gonna pay for this, and we're going to take it to the next step. Okay, we're gonna review the order. Obviously we agreed to all the terms and conditions and now we're going to place our order. Okay, your order's been received. Thank you for your purchase. You have an order number. Uh, you'll receive an order confirmation email with the uh, details of your order and a link to track its progress. If you've purchased a software download, please review the how to authorize your product email for download and authorization details. All right, so right now we can do one of a couple different things. We can either click on here to go get our presets that we purchased, or I'll show you another way as well too. So we're gonna click on here, preset and IRs. Okay, so there we are, it's sitting right there. All right, we click on that and we're ready to download. And there it is. Okay, so as you can see, the zip file went to my downloads directory. I'm going to double click it. Okay, it's going to extract it. Okay, the next important step here is we have to have HX set it open and you'll make sure you also have the most recent version of HX set it, the most current version of HX set it. Very, very important. And also, it's also equally important to have the most recent firmware on, in this case, your Stomp. Okay, so we need to log into our account. At the bottom left, you'll see the account icon. Click on that, click on sign in. Got our, our username, put on our password. Okay, and we are now signed in, all right? If you can't get signed in there, you might have a password issue or something like that. You might have to choose forgot password, anything of that nature. So we're just gonna pick where we want to choose to put the presets for now. We can move them around later. I'm just gonna highlight the first preset where I wanna put it, in this case, 24B. I'm gonna click on, click on it to highlight it. I'm gonna click on import, and I'm gonna browse to where I just left off, which was in my downloads directory, and there's two presets. So on my Mac, I'm gonna hit shift. You can also do the same thing on a, on a PC and select the second one, click on it, and I'm gonna hit open, okay? And we say, uh, it says, are you sure you want to overwrite the highlighted presets? They're blank anyways, and I'm gonna say yes. Okay, and there we go. Okay, so we're back to the main website here again where we just physically downloaded our presets, but if that hadn't worked, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna click on the little uh, avatar here for the, the account. 
We're going to go down a little bit down to Helix Marketplace. And here we are again. This will take us right back to the same spot again that we can physically click on that and re-download it. Okay, so I was almost done shooting this video here today and I thought, you know what, I better show you PodGo Edit because it's a little bit of a different process. Getting the presets for your PodGo are 100% the same. Going to the website, signing in, buying them and downloading them, 100% the same. Just getting them onto your device is just very, very slightly different only because of the software. What you saw me using was HX Edit and that will allow you to download and import presets for anything from Helix, HX Effects and HX Stomp. So right now we're going to jump over to uh, Pod Go Edit. Same idea exactly as you saw before. We just want to highlight where we want to put our uh, presets at. Um, and of course, you want to make sure you're not overwriting a preset that you like or you've created. Uh, always a good idea to back up your presets. Um, there's no real import um, menu here, as you can see. So we have to go up to File and go Import Preset. Okay. Now this we're going to be using my Pod Go bundle, for example. And there's quite a few. There's ten presets inside the bundle. We're going to go Import Preset. Now these ones I already have saved on my computer. We're going to go here to Pod Go Starter Kit. I'm going to click on the first one, and I'm going to click on the. I'm going to hold the Shift key down. I'm going to click on the last one, and I'm going to go Open. Are you sure you want to overwrite the highlighted presets? They're blank. That's fine. Let me go Go. And there you go. You've got my uh, Pod Go Starter Kit 10 preset bundle. Easy as that. So hopefully you were able to follow along and by this time have successfully downloaded your new presets. If this video was of help to you, please consider showing your support by liking and subscribing. Thanks again and be sure to check out all the awesome sellers at Line 6 Marketplace. Until next time, from Music Gear Network, I'm Eric Broadbent. Cheers. Cheers.